hello so now let's see about the statistics on this video the statistics command is nothing but the statistics of all the drives nodes and hardware software that are present in the cluster so the statistics nothing but the file system statistics that will be sent to the inside iq so in inside iq we'll be able to see all the read write operations and uh, network errors average cpu usage all those things so that can be seen here in the command line so for that we'll go with easy statistics and let's go with the drive so this will list all the statistics of that particular drive so on node 1 so here you can see the drive the drive type and the ops in and bytes ops out time average time incurred and queued and bc all the things will show here and let's see about the node is the statistics nodes so the client so you can check all the clients that are connected to this cluster currently so this will list all the uh, client connections okay so we'll go with another command client so you can you can use uh, more than 1500 combinations in this uh, these are the options that are available you can grab it by class so you can grab it by class is equal to so you can give the classes whatever you need or if you want to go for one particular node you can just give nodes is equal to one and if you want to go for all the nodes node is equal to all show all the three nodes so like this you can use several combinations to get the exact report that you need so then go with uh, heat so this will show you the blocked lookup and whatever um, operation that has been taken place it will show everything here it will just kind of a log database log all the general logs it will show everything and let's go with another command the statistics protocol so if you want to search in the protocol you can list the protocols and it will show all the protocols I mean read write uh, or sorry the NFS SMB all those things and if you want to go with the operations uh, let's go with the system so this will give you the overall uh, you know statistics of the system so it's like you know what are the protocols that are uh, currently in use and how much percentage are in use so here you can see SMB, FTP, HTTP, NFS and it shows for all the nodes and if you want to grab it for one particular node i for a node is equal to 1 so it will list for one node 1 here you can see and also you can order it you can also or you can also order it order by you can use several options here okay so that's it's not working for this particular command so let's go with another drives sorry list hyphen hyphen so i think uh oh, yeah i can use sort that's been changed sort So here you can go for the help option if you want to find out the other combinations that are available. So here you can see the type hyphen hyphen sort. So you can sort by any time or drive or type of the you know IOPS. So all those things we can sort it out. So let's say I will just go with uh, this list. So it will sort on the drive basis. So like that you can sort it with the metrics that you need. Let's check the other command. So the statistics and workload. So if you want to check the workload, workload list. So this will show you what are the uh, no workload that are happening and what are the cash, uh, how much the cash percentage are used. So CPU. The read write the l2 l3 cache and what is the node that is connected to 
and what is the system name so this c log mcp so mcp is nothing but the master control protocol so that is a protocol it is that will manage all the other uh, you know, uh, operations in one of us so mcp will run on each node and that will copy all the operations to the other nodes and you have the system you have easy upgrade uh, agent daemon and uh, easy underscore migrate this is one, one particular service and you can see all the daemons are currently running so that's why it's showing on the workload and we'll go with the say statistics p stat so this will give you uh, the NFS operations and CPU utilization on of a state all, all those things in one single window you can see the read write the packets that has been transferred and uh, network input network output disk ops everything you can see here so in terms of troubleshooting the network uh, issues you will have to always go with the statistics command so EC statistics will have a lot of information related to the network things so whenever there is a troubleshooting that you have to do through uh, uh, you know on this uh, cluster you go with the CLI on this statistics command so this will give you all the information that you need and query and you can go for the history so you have to give the uh, date and uh, time on the history command uh, I'll, I'll check for the current one So yeah, you can use all these uh, you know, sub commands like you know that limit uh, the time interval on that particular time if you want to check if you want, can check on the time and if you want to go with the one particular node or if you have to go with the type of info you can go with hive reference type f info so all these things you can use to get the uh, desired output so yeah so th there are like you know a lot of combinations available on the statistics command to get the network details the current network details or the history or the logs of the uh, you know network uh, details that has happened before so all these things you can get through this is a statistics command so i'll give you a uh, you know comments sheet on this uh, course you can use make use of that that will help you in terms of troubleshooting and internet of issues that's it for this lecture. We'll see you in the next lecture.